Hi, I'm Elga Valovirta. This is something that many of you have requested. So here it is. 1959 hand wired 100 plexi versus Marshall JZM 800. I have two here the bad boy from 84 with 6550 power tubes and the little brother from 85 with ER 34s. First, let's go through the signal chain. So, this is my warm old strat I put together EMG 81. I'm gonna only use that. Because we're not going to do cleans now. We're going to do overdriven toes with and without bus SD1. Then it goes to my pedal board where I have two different bus SDs. So how I program my setup is that a JSM 800 is with this overdrive here, my old one. And then a Flexi is with the Wasacraft, but it's on the standard mode. I just have a tiny bit more drive. All amps are connected to the KHO the electronics amp switcher and then they go to my 1960BX Marshall 1960BX cab through Fright power station where I'm attenuating the signal a bit. And then uh, what I have there is green box and cream box. So now what you will hear is a cream box 65M mic'd with Sennheiser MD421 and Shure SM57. And then also I blend it in a little bit lower in volume, a Creamback 75H with the H magnet, and that is mic'd with Shure SM57 and S Electronics VR1 ribbon mic. First, let's go through with the Super Overdrive. Just gonna play a similar riff that I, I, I've used on, on these Plexi videos. The amp settings, someone's gonna ask anyway. Today they are. Plexi, everything on 10, <laughs> except uh, volume 2 is on 4, so I've jumped the, to the channels. The bad boy, presence 4, bass 9, mix 6, treble 6, master 2, which with their normal 800, it's like 4 or 5, real loud. Uh, preamp 7, which again, like with the normal normal 800, it, it's full. Because these old uh, JCM 800s or Marshalls in general, they could be very different from each other. Some have less gain, some have more gain, some are really loud. Like this one, the, the master volume control don't go up like this, it goes straight. I've dialed this a few times past noon, and uh, the power tubes exploded, and the output transformer exploded. So. It's a bit special. <laughs> so it's loud, the power tubes are working. 6550s. EO34 one, presence 4, base 8, mix 6, treble 6, volume, that's two and a half. So that's not as steep the, the you know volume curve on the bad boy. Preamp is the same, preamp is 7. These are just my settings for today. Plexi is pretty much always like that, everything on 10, but 800 differs depending on the guitar, what I'm looking for, what speaker I use. If I use a, a V30 or Marshall Vintage, I usually might back the mids a little bit. But anyway, those are the settings today. Let's start with a bad boy. The guitar is in drop D flat tuning. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention, I'm running the Plexi with the Variac. The Variac is set to 160, because here in Europe the voltage is between 220 and 240. And I'm getting now... Oh, I'm only getting 217. Usually it's 220 or 225. Okay, it's really low. Let's start with the, with the 800. So yeah, Variac set to 160. And what I'm getting is only 217 now. First the bad boy.
right that was with the super overdrives then sd is off let's start with the bad boy <laughs> Let's take that riff again with the super overdrive with all amps. First, the, the bad boy. <laughs> Conclusion. Like you heard, they all sound, at least in my opinion, pretty damn good, but quite different. Even the two 800s, well, they're slightly different. But uh, Plexi, the original 100 waters where it all started, set up like this, everything on full, except the volume 2 on 4. You get the 
most gain you can get out from the plexi and then with the variac i'm kind of taming it down so it's not so all over the place i like the feel and i like the sound what i get with the variac like i said now i have set it to 160. lots of mitch quite smooth top little bit uh kind of tighter low end and then Marshall, which was evolution of the Plexi, JMP2203, you know, they looked like this. They just had two inputs and then they rebranded it as JCM800 in the early 80s. More bottom, uh, a bit more fuller scooped, more upper or that high silver. It's just a more modern and with the master volume, even though I had it pretty loud, it kind of stays tighter and again modern, more modern since the, the gain is happening. It's happening in the power amp, but mostly it's happening in the preamp. Whereas with Plexi, the gain is happening both in the preamp, because there's less than on the 800, but also a lot is happening in the power amp section where you get the this plexi plexi style sound i like them both a lot two of my favorite uh, amplifiers and a 5150 it's it's awesome too i really like like that 5150 is too but uh if you're looking for a more vintage 60s 70s maybe early 80s rock slash metal sound you know you can get that with plexi but if you're looking for 80s 90s 2000s nowadays more modern rock and metal sound then at least my choice is jcm 800 and if you want to cover them all like i do then you gotta have both Hey, hopefully you found this interesting and informative. Thanks for watching and if you liked, please hit the thumbs up, subscribe and the bell button to when you get, you know that really, you know, notification whenever I post a new video. Anyway, hey, thanks again for, for checking this out and uh, take care. We'll see you on the next one. Bye.